This is the percentage question asked in UPSC C set 2011. So this question is asking UPSC civil services exams paper C set in 2011. So the question is there are 100 students. How many students are given? 100. In a particular class, 60% student play cricket, 30% student play football and 10% student play both the games. Right. What is the number of student who play neither neither cricket nor football? So we will solve it through Venn diagram method. That is the easiest method, right? So suppose this is a circle representing the student who are playing cricket and this is a circle representing the student who are playing football. And this section, this section will show who are playing both cricket and football, right? So there may be candidate who are not playing any games, right? So through Venn diagram, we know that this rectangular will represent 100%, right? So they, they have given like there are 100 students. So we can write here, not 100%, we will write 100. So how many students are playing cricket? 60%. So 60% of 100 will be 60 only. Okay. And... How many students are playing football? 30%. So it will be 30% of 100 will be 30. Right. And 10% students play both. So this shaded area will be 10% of 100. So it will be 10. Right. So I am writing it A, B or C. Now, a plus B will be 60 because it is representing the total number of student playing cricket. Right. A plus B is representing what? This circle is representing what? The total number of student playing cricket. So we know B, B is 10. So A will be? So A will be 50. Right. So we can write 50. And similarly B plus C is? B plus C is representing number of student playing football. So that is given 30. We know what is B. B is 10. 10 plus C is equal to 30. So C will be 20. Right. So now the number of student who are playing either cricket or football. Right. So A plus B plus C. So how many students are playing either cricket or football or they are playing both games. So total number of student participating in games will be 50 plus we have to add this 50 plus 10 plus 20. Right. So it will be total 80. So 80 students are playing games. So how many students who are not playing any games? Total number of students are 100. So we can minus 80 from 100. Right. So it will come 20. So there are 20 students who are not playing any games. So the answer will be option B. Right. I hope you have understood.